Hi guys, Barnaby for Spurred on outside the lane where it's looking very much like we've just lost 1-0 to Crystal Palace in the cup. We've got Kieran and Nathaniel here. Kieran, what did you think of it? What did you make? Uh, first half, I thought we was pretty on top, to be honest. So I thought we could have gone up 2-0 or, or whatever, but um, obviously they scored. I didn't actually see the goals in the toilet. But, um, <laughs> um, but, Thanks for that, yeah. appreciate it. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but anyway, um, second half, we just had nothing about us. I didn't think it was slow. Final third, nothing clicked. Um, I thought, was, I thought Deli Ali didn't have one of his better games, to be honest. He did hit the yeah. post three times yeah, in the first yeah, half. Like, in the first, no, I'm not going to take that away from him, but second half, it like usually we run our play through him, and unfortunately, um, he, he just didn't click second half. But um, can't fault him. He's been our player of the season, well, one of our, our players of the season so far. But um, it's a cup exit. Um, maybe just concentrate on the league. Yeah, so Nathaniel, how do you feel about it? I think for me, it's a bit like. You, you're playing against a team who put out their best team. They're, they're a decent Premier League side. When we played them in the league here, we only just beat them 1-0. They had their best team out apart from maybe um, Balassi, and we kind of played mix and match, and I think it, it suited them, really. It became a scrappy game. We just didn't do enough in the final third. We're too slow. We need, to, we need something that's gonna, someone's going to bring energy in that final third that's going to do something that's going to make people think, all right, cool, we need to worry about this guy. There's no one there today that was... On form, I reckon today, Deli Ali was obviously first half. I personally reckon he should have had two. Um, I thought the second one where it hit the post was in. Um, obviously, Kabai was on the line. I think it was in the first one. Um, but I mean, it's just I don't know. There was nothing. There wasn't some, anything about us today. Um, and like you say, yeah, there was too many changes, and it, like it does play into their hands. If they've got a squad that, that where they know they're starting eleven, and they're used to playing with each other, and then we make five or six, seven changes, however many it was today. It's 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 not going to be able to you're not going to be able to click straight away and that that's where I think obviously we we made made it, uh, mistakes but Ben Sleb for me today was shocking yeah. um, that's that that's the one player for me that I thought all right cool it's good to see him back in the squad yeah, hopefully he does something this is his chance to obviously assert himself and prove why he should be even thought about in the yeah. starting eleven over Dembele or or Dyer obviously Dyer playing a different position today but. He, he was shocking, absolutely yeah, shocking. That combo in the middle yeah, that, of yeah. Dembele and um, I mean, I, Dyer. I personally think we should. We should. I know it's we've got the league to focus on, but we needed Alderweireld there today to kind of yeah. someone solid that that is going to. He's a general at the back, man. Like we needed that. Obviously, Wimmer's doing excellent since he's come in, mm -hmm. but those two together, maybe obviously they don't have that understanding that the, the other three centre backs do. So I, I don't know. Okay, and just uh, one one word answers. Will we turn Fiorentina over? Get to the next round of the Europa League on Thursday next match. I'm confident. I reckon two 0 All right, guys, you heard it here first. Uh, let us know what you thought. Of their comments in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on YouTube. Follow us on Twitter at Spud on TV. Cheers, guys.